Thought we'd throw in this little video in the middle of the series that we're currently doing. It was a bit of a day trip Nicholas and I did. Uh, we're looking for new tracks for a run that we're going to be doing come New Year. So there's been a bit of interest in a 33, 35 inch modified, an easier one that we would do in bullet truck. That's a bit of carnage there. Do you think the RNG can get up next? Who? Oh, I don't know. It's pretty well, tall. It. Well, it makes it, doesn't it? Nicholas and I have come out for a day trip to potentially find some new tracks for a trip we'll run in the new year for the smaller trucks, the locked still, you know, the 33 to 35 inch size tyres. We're in there playing with the RC car and a young fella walks over looking pretty distressed in gumboots with mud halfway up them. Stay tuned for what happens next. I'll put a link down below for any inquiries for this particular run. It's going to be happening early 2022 and we'll keep you guys posted. I think we found some good stuff. We also came across a little recovery. So that was a good call there, Nicholas, on the rear diff. We really stuffed it up, didn't we? Maybe I should do this. You know what, you need another little rock here, look. Now I'm not going to hide him. Try, no, no, I reckon. That's it. Look at him go. Oh, turn, 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 turn. No, nah, you got to back it up. No, 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 you're going to break something. You're caught up on that rock. The Sugarloaf series will be back next video. So keep the votes coming for your favourite truck or the truck you think did the best. Use the bank. Come up this side. Yeah, that's it. Good boy. Nah, you turned too early. Go back. Now go up. Yeah, yeah. Go now. Go left. Go left now. That's it. Now go. Yeah. Oh, I thought you had it. It's a fine line. It reminds me of that. Oh, that hub hill we did not long ago, where you had to, you know, straddle it, and I kept slipping in. Oh, it's not deep. Nice one. The RC action's come to a bit of a stop. We just had a young fella come and ask us. He's stuck down there somewhere in mud. No recovery gear. So we'll go see what we can do. We've got no winch, so it could be an issue. Put your belt on, buddy. I wonder how stuck he is. He's come walking out in gumboots. Oh dear. Mud is bad. I know. Yep, here comes the rain. There he is. Oh, that was quite deep. Let's go around the back of him and see what he's got up here. We'll go 
around the back of him and this is probably the chicken track around the mud but hang on a minute no it's not Bugger. is there a way around that Well, I don't need to get stuck, so we'll we'll go back, have a look. It all looks the same at the moment. So much rain we've had, so slippery. So which way did you come in? Straight, like straight in. Oh, you were coming from that way? Yeah, yeah. I'm thinking through here. Cut through here. Okay. So you might get stuck. I know, but I want you staying there. So I'm going to try and stay out of those big puddles. Th this one, these ones. They just spill them. Out. You're not going to get it. It's just so slippery. Yeah, we're go a bit, go a bit more, go a bit more. Go further back. Just go back past my car. Nice, nice. Well done. All right, how are we going to get, because I've got to go back that side, where he is. Hello. <laughs> Just another lesson of always put your recovery gear in. I wasn't expecting to do anything hard today. We, Nicholas and I were just coming out to drive the RC cars. Young fella here said he's got all the recovery gear at home and he was stuck. Lucky I had something in myself. Now if you haven't already, please subscribe, please share, comment down below, give a like. We're almost at 4,000 subscribers and I really want to grow this channel and give you guys a lot more videos. As always,